Welcome to this week's episode of Sportsman's Journal. As you can see, Tyler is already at it. <laughs> he has started casting. I'm excited. We have some weather coming in this evening, so we only have limited amount of time on the water today. Um, so we're trying to beat the storm and get the fish that we need. So of course, the more casts, the better off we are. I'm here, I'm but, focused. <laughs> but I'm back. We are really excited to be on the water today. We have a uh, brand new. Brand new, Northland straight tackle. out of the package. Sarah and I are really lucky. We get to use a lot of new tackle from Northland. So we're excited about their new rigged gumball swim jigs. And they got rigged minnows. And they got rigged grubs. Yeah. New stuff. So we're excited to get out and try it. As you can see, I'm really pumped. And I like it because <laughs> it's pre-rigged. So it's ready and good to go. You don't have to worry about which way the tail goes. Or, That's right. It's you know, all rigged up for you. Put kind of in. a grab and go thing. Yeah. So and everything eats a swim bait, right? Yeah, we're gonna find out today, hopefully. Uh, so we're fishing in spring and um, we are targeting walleye. And spring walleye mean aggressive walleye That's usually. Right. And we kind of got the combination of the storm coming in and wind and spring, so feed bags. So the swim jig should be able to be worked however we want. So I'm excited for that. Well, I'm excited too. Sarah mentioned that the walleyes are on the move and that's typical for spring. We've had three really nice days in a row and we get the storm coming in and we're gonna have wind. And in my opinion, we, we, we have differing opinions of wind. I love the wind. You can see it's pushing us all over the place. I love the wind for spring especially because that pushes that bait fish in certain locations a little easier to pattern the fish. And I think because of that wind, because of the storm coming, fish are going to be active and we're going to have to move. And there's nothing better than casting swim baits, kind of power fishing, yeah, a cover bit. a lot of water, yeah. catch some walleyes. I'm excited to do it. I might make another cast because this stuff that we're coming up to looks prime. Yes, so we want to get out there and catch as many fish as possible. So stay tuned. We will be right back with hopefully a few fish in the boat. You bet. This segment of Sportsman's Journal is brought to you by Stryker. For their full lineup of UPF gear, check out strikerbrands.com. been looking for. Nice work. Came up and just walloped it. It's a good starter fish. It is. Don't you think? Do you want the net? You got him, don't you, or no? I think so. I'm just That's a little a dandy nervous walleye. if he gets away on her. We've been waiting for him. And we have. Come here, walleye friend. Good fish. Thank you. Right out of that log there, hon? Uh, yeah. Actually, it was way up on the... Whoa! Way up by the... <laughs> Look at that. He obviously likes it. Yum. Yeah. He likes pink! What the heck? <laughs> yeah, well pink is a good color, you know? Came up and just walloped it. Smacked really her. shallow, yep. And just kind of jerk and let it fall and... Where he was there. Boom. Yeah, that is what we've been looking for, that beautiful gold. Nice fish. Thank you. Nice eye. Wow came up and drilled it. That was sweet. Yeah, it was. Wow. Just annihilated that thing. That was awesome. <laughs> that was like a muskie. Yeah, it was. He did. He came in like I a muskie. I mean, musky. he wanted it too. That was awesome. Yes. Nicely so, done. Yeah. That, he did. He came in like a muskie and just, just boom. Boom. I haven't had a walleye hit like that in a long time. No, that was super cool. And I was like, oh my gosh! Yeah, look at this. This is that! Old Mr. White in the old tip of the snout. Here we there go. There you go. Look at that. Dandy fish. Wow. Long and lean. That is so cool. Post spawn <laughs> coming up here and putting the feed bags on. Mm -hmm. Tearing up the new Northland swim jig. White and pink seems to be doing good. Yeah, we seem to We be got doing a variety good. of colors we're going to be using today, but yes, we that's do. what we're starting out with. We're getting some fish. I love it. Fun. Back in there. See you later. One thing you want to remember when fishing walleyes in the spring 
is after they spawn, they go and recoup a little bit. The big females, the ones we're kind of catching today, you can see they're really skinny, slender. They go out and they kind of recoup and there's about a 20 to 30 day period where they kind of roam around deeper water, recuperate, don't do a whole lot of feeding. And then you get that first really kind of warm up in the spring. About 30 days after they spawn, they come up and they hit that first area, the first kind of break. And that's what they're doing. They're coming up in this, most of the fish we saw today so far have been what, nine foot? Right around, nine, yeah. Nine, 10 yep. feet. And they're starting to eat. We see small schools, two or three fish. And that's the thing you gotta remember is they're moving around. Cause you gotta fish fast and you gotta cover a lot of water, find those roaming schools of walleyes that wanna eat. So cover water, move a lot, find those windblown shorelines, use a bait that you can fish fast that can do different things too. And that's perfect what this gumball swim jig's doing for us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fish. There we go. Nice job. Come out and pop her. Yep. Spot lock it or? I don't know. What do you think? Stand down. Feel like an eye? I don't know, it feels. I like it. Feels heavy. How do you whack her? Good. Yeah. Well, I've been. I so I tried. Some, I switched it up a little bit, and I was actually trying to just jig it off the bottom. Uh huh. And. Uh, what is it? It's an eyeball. Yeah, it is a dandy. Yeah. Nice. It's a nice one. And um, spot came lock up is and on. Just oh, he it. golfed her too, honey. Nice. Ah. I always feel like a sense of Good relief job. when you get it in the net. I think he picked it up off the bottom. Honestly. Well, you know what? That's the cool thing about swim baits is that you can wow. do. I don't have a good. You could do a lot of different there. stuff with them, right? Yeah. Straight retrieve, pop, jig, troll, snap jig. I mean. Yeah, we had a nice breeze and it kind of calmed down a little bit, and then so I just thought, well, I'll just try jigging it off the bottom, and. Uh, and sure enough. There sure you enough, go. Look at that. Wow. Nice job. Gosh, I love Beautiful. That. I just, love whew, it. Yes. Dandy I love fish. It. So some of the beauty of these baits is that you can work them a lot differently to any any condition or what you feel comfortable with, and. I've noticed that a lot of these fish are pinning it, you know, kind of on the fall. Yeah, you're catching way more fish than I am with a straight retrieve. I'm doing a straight retrieve and you're doing a little pop, little yeah, pop I've been doing jig, a little swim pop. jig type thing. So I'm, I'm kind of almost jigging it back to the boat, swimming, swimming it back and it's falling. It's that paddle tail, so it's getting that motion on the way down, that vibration. And then I, I feel like the fish are pinning it on the bottom. Oh yeah. And then um, I have a little bit of slack at my, the top of my jig, so that's why I'm reeling back into it. And just, you know, exaggeratory kind of setting the hook, but I want to make sure when I have that slack that I don't let any more slack out. You know, until I reel back against. Until you realize that it's a that and, yeah, make six sure pound it's a walleye. Fish. Sometimes it's a snag. <laughs> we never get snagged, no, do we? No, no, no. But uh, I don't at least. That's that's what I've been doing. That's kind of the technique I've been. What's been working? Yeah. Oh oh oh! You're kidding me. There we go. That feels like, that looks like a better fish. Yeah. I'm gonna spot lock it. You were jigging it again, weren't you? Yes, I was, and my rod tip was like up in the air, so I don't feel like it was the best hook set, but. Keep it pinned. It's heavy. It I'm feels coming good. in with the net. <sighs> feels like a better fish. Feels like a better fish? Yeah. Have you made eye contact yet? Uh, I just saw it flash. This is a big eye, this is gonna be nice. I know. Let me get out of the way. Yeah, watch that motor fish. I can turn it off. We gotta get eyes on this I thing. I know. I'm a little worried about my drag. It's not good. pulling out, but it's a ski. It's a big ski. Jeez. Is that a big ski or is it a pike? Pretty sure it's a ski. I'm gonna turn her. I'm gonna hop down in the bottom of the boat. Right, lift up. No. Okay, when I do this, my arm's not gonna last for very long. Okay, I got her right here. Okay. Wow, that's a nice one. There we go. Jeez, oh Look geez. at that. I love it. Oh. North has got a good product. You can I like see it. that she was splashy hey. in the net, so you're, I got a little catching, wet here. You're uh, catching a lot of different species of fish today, and you're doing it casting out jigging. Oh my gosh. This the is crazy. Bait. All right, we're gonna get her back. Oh. Ready? Oh, there, she cooperated nicely on the release. Wow. That was awesome. The Rumble Shad from Northland Tackle. You get unmatched precision that gets you farther and is true on the troll. Not only mimics shad, but its unique design and wicked color patterns covers perch and panfish too. Northland Tackle. We are walleye. This segment of Sportsman's Journal is brought to you by Northland Fishing Tackle. 
Plan your next fishing trip at northlandtackle.com. It's a walleye. It's decent. I can't quite tell what it is yet. I think it's an eye. Oh, it's a walleye. I yeah, got the net. I'm gonna yeah, spot lock us here. That fish came up and whomped it. Whoa, 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 whoa! Nice. Yeah, I got spot lock. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, it's windy. <laughs> oh, he's off. Nice. God. It's all about the wind. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All about the wind. Those walleyes whoa. love the wind. Man, he is. Not happy to be in the bag. No, here, he's he? not. He doesn't want you touching him. Yeah, we're gonna put him on TV here real quick. Just a quick little shotty. Everybody wants to say hi. There, look at. Yes. Nice. Yeah, he's ready to go back in here. That's a long and lean fish. Post spawner. Up there looking to feast. Wow. That's I got him in the act. You know what I mean? <laughs> got him <laughs> red-handed. Let's put him back in. Busted. There. Sarah, that wind. It's helping us out catch a lot of fish. It is getting them stirred up, I it think. It is. <laughs> getting them stirred up. That's a good way to put it. We talked it behind a little bay here so we can talk a little more about the rig. Yeah, I didn't want my hair blowing jig. in my face. No, you don't like that? No. 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 Uh, can you grab me another skirt over there? This yeah. one's a little beat up. The cool thing about these baits is that they're super easy to rig. They got a hook guide Definitely channel. Definitely a and reason I like them. So you're, they tell you how to hook them basically all the time. All you got to mm -hmm. do is just follow the, the hole in the head of the bait and you follow it right out and you've got a true you got a, it's rigged perfect every time so you get a true run by the bait so the bait's never running cockeyed or upside down or backwards or whatever so might they happen. come in the package with some already rigged yep. and then they come with extra bodies and yep. so tyler's body got pretty got pretty beat, beat up, yeah. up so then you, you just, to put you just follow on. the guide yep. down the hook guide right through the bait comes out catches a lot of fish one big thing that i like it and we talked about it a lot already is that it's versatile as all get out Yes, that they is do a definitely. Lot of stuff. I mean, Sarah and I are probably are not doing the same thing on two casts the entire day so no. far. No, and I think I think that that we should talk about that. Like, mm -hmm. so it's easy to use. It's a yep. versatile bait, so you can use it in all sorts of different conditions. Yep. And so, like, if you are an angler who's just getting started, or an angler who is used to live bait and wants to get yeah. introduced to soft plastics, because it is it is kind of a skill to to thread on your. To get your soft, soft plastic plastic. You don't want on pinks correct. In it. You don't want it to be upside down a lot of times. <laughs> yeah. So you got to have it right. And they come ready to rock and roll. Yep. And the other thing that I like about it, and I talk a lot about baits that catch us fish, is that it works. Well, yes, that's a huge, that's a, probably the number one that thing you're going to look for in a bait is do fish bite it? Yeah, so the fish <laughs> like it. I like it. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about them. I think they're yeah. going to catch a lot of fish for people. Yeah, they're proving themselves. They're proving <laughs> themselves. Uh, are we going to prove ourselves to catch more fish in the wind? Well, yeah, we have to. I am a huge I mean, fan of the wind. you you got to work on building a relationship with the wind, you know what I mean? Yeah, the wind and I have a love-hate relationship. Yeah, well, I love or it. frenemies. Frenemies? Yes. Is that an actual thing? It is, yeah. Okay, well, mm -hmm. let's go make frenemies with some more walleye. What do you think? <laughs> fish? Yeah. Nice. Big fish? Oh. Feel good? I felt a head shake. All right, I'm spot-locking. Is it an eye? You are just, I'm feeling head shakes. You are killing it. It's a big spin. Wow, here, here we go, here, yeah. Big spin <laughs> the boat, the There's boat not a whole is lot moving. I can do with the wind. Nope. I understand. Oh. oh, head shakes like crazy. I think it's a... I think it's an eye. I don't want to jinx myself. No. You don't think it's an eye? I don't know. I'm saying oh. don't jinx yourself. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't no, see no, anything. No, no, no. If it's an eye, it's a big fish. It's, it's got the head shakes. Yeah, it does. It sounds like all I've been doing lately is just standing by with the net. You know what I mean? Yeah. Grab my net. Gra grab a net for me. Big eye. Big eye. Big eye. Big eye. Big eye. One we want. Yes. Nice job, buddy. Yeah. yeah. Good Woo! fish. That feels good. Yes. That feels really good. I, I love, love it. it. Wow. <laughs> I'm excited. Time. Hey, buddy. Sarah, yeah. good job. That is sweet. This is a big Woo! eye. Big eye on a swim bait. 
literally five minutes after you caught that muskie, we just kind of went over and fished another bay that's getting, of course, pounded by the wind. I'm just gonna sneak right here next and to you. We talk a lot about conditions and how that affects oh fish. Oh my gosh, the head on this yeah, barrel. Yeah, but when you have stable weather and you have wind, fish the wind blown shorelines. That's like that's the biggest chunk of advice we can give you. The second biggest chunk of advice we can give you. Keep casting. Put a Northland swim bait on and catch some fish. Wow. Wow. I that love is it. Dandy. Good job, Sarah. I love <laughs> the it. The head on that fish yeah, is huge. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. You got the hot hand. I'm yeah. liking it. Nice yeah, work. I, I'm liking it too. I'm not gonna lie. Wow. Nice. Get her back in there, honey. <laughs> yes. Beauty fish. Oh my goodness. I love it. All right. Have you seen the scissors? Back to swim. The scissors? Yeah, I'm gonna take your pink jig. Ha ha. <laughs> no. That thing is producing awesome fish, Sarah. Yeah, that was nice. I love it. Oh, oh, oh. What's a fish? I know it is. Thanks for pointing that out, though. I got it, too. Little feels fish. good. No, it Does feels, it? It feels decent. Really? Yeah. Uh, I think he's charging the boat. Do you want me to spot lock here? Well, I I'm mean, gonna. Okay. We're gonna swing big time here. Well, I'm gonna. Have you seen the fish yet? Nope. How did that one hit? You're. Is this a big fish? Is this a big eye? I don't know. Oh, here he goes. Is this a big eye? Have you seen it yet? No. This is one of those deals where you never get to see him. No. Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm guessing it's not. I'm guessing it's not, but. Wow, what do you got here? Sir, we're supposed to be fishing for walleyes. I know, I'm sorry. Oh, geez. Okay, here he goes. I saw a flash, but I don't know you what You might have it to was. go to the back of the yep, boat. Go to the back of the boat. I want to just strip my <laughs> reel. What do you got? I don't know yet. I really, really, really don't know yet. But I'm guessing it's another muskie. Or a big pike? Or a big pike, yeah. This is supposed to be a walleye exhibition. I'm sorry. I'm just. That wind is tough. This is this must be a really big fish. It feels good. I should probably get the net. <laughs> this, the anticipation is just killing. Our me. undersized net. Okay, she's coming up. She's coming up. Oh my goodness! It's another nice oh. ski. Okay. Oh, that's a nice one. That's oh a my dandy. goodness. Okay. Ugh, that wind is horrible. Okay, I'm gonna try to turn. All right, her. here she comes. Here she comes. Oh my gosh! Did you hear my reel? Lift! Lift, Trampy, lift! She's off too. <laughs> look at that. Wow, both of them in the net both like that. All right, Woo! let's get this fish quick in for a quick shot and we'll get it right back in the water. All right. Another dandy muskie. I love it. Oh my Multi goodness. Multi species bonanza. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Just nice job. Swimming, swimming the swim jig. <laughs> do to do, and boom. We like wow. these. That's fun. This is yes, fun fishing. Fun. And when they really hit it, they fun. pound it, don't they? Yes, they do. All right. That's awesome. I'm putting her back. Okay. Spotlot's working like a champ right now. Cast up by that rock. There's got to be a walleye on this. Where do you think I am? There he is. There he is. Nice job. That looks like another good one. Yeah. You are just pounding them. I'm feeling head shakes are too. Are you? Now so this I'm is gonna be a chore. When it's windy, the net man has almost the most impossible job. Trying to net your fish without oh, knocking cool. it off. I think the camera <laughs> guy's got it. The, the, the <laughs> camera guy's working hard right now. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness, another dandy. <laughs> there, you're off again. And we're out, wow. Perfect, nice fish. Woo. Let's get a look. That storm is breathing down our neck. Yeah, it is. But when you got pressure dropping, it's good yep. fishing. You so got you gotta fish keep, fighting, that's you know, for gotta sure. Gotta keep pounding. Wow. All right. Go in. There you go, fish. The spot lock's working today. Wow. Wow. This fish does not want to be handled. I mean, not that other fish like to be handled, but wow. It's just a Stocky model. Right yeah, it there. is a Look stocky model. Nice job. Show off of the camera. Oh man. Let's we better get, get back. Couple, yeah, get a couple more casts in yeah, here. Yeah, we gotta get back out there. Look at how dark that thing is. Wow. How about that right in? It's a good one. <laughs> We're safe and sound. <laughs> we are. That storm kind of, we knew it was coming, but we uh, had been watching the radar and I thought yep. we had a little more time and then the wind just picked up 
and rapidly mm -hmm. and uh, we needed to move. So we came in, tied the boat up, got the cover on, put everything away just in the nick of time. Yeah, just in the nick of time. And that's the kind of the big thing that we were hoping for was that storm coming because it was kind of the perfect ingredients for what we were looking for early season. That water starting to warm up three really mm -hmm. nice days in a row with that storm right on the back end and right. then the cold front coming tomorrow. It's supposed to be like a 10 or 15 degree drop. So that's perfect for spring. You want warm, 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 plus a storm on top, pressure change. Fish were eating. Get those feed bags on. Get those Absolutely. feed bags on, yep. And uh, we had a really good day trying out Northland's new pre-rig swim baits. Mm -hmm. um, I really, really like the ease and convenience of it. Yep. Um, just tie on and you're ready to go. And even if you have to change out your skirt with the pre-rigged hole, yep. uh, the guide where you can put your hook, that is just Helped Perfect. Out. Yeah, yep. I really enjoyed that. I and, really liked and it. And putting on a skirt seems like, well, that's easy. Everybody can put a skirt on. Well, you got to get it and, right. Well, until you try. Because <laughs> if you want that bait to run right, if you have a kink in the skirt or it's mm -hmm. off-center, you're not going to get the same vibration right. from that paddle tail. Right, and you're not going to get as many hits. And that's a big deal. Um, the other thing that I really like about it, and you talked about this a little bit, is it looks simple. I mean, what is it? It's a soft plastic and a jig head. Right. But it's extremely effective and versatile. You can do so many different things with it. Right. I mean, we, so, I mean, just for example, for today, in the hours that we fished today, we caught almost every species in the lake. Yep. We fished multiple structures mm -hmm. and we fished it different techniques. Yep. I was jigging at points. We were straight yep. retrieving at points. So you can use Northland's new swim bait in many different applications. Yep. So different seasons, you can use it for different species. It doesn't really matter what the water temp right. is as long as you're using the right practical application for that bait. And it, proven it proved itself yep i was also blown away by the fact that you caught some really nice muskies oh, on it my skill level skill well i wasn't gonna skill. my skill level <laughs> with the net jobs was phenomenal okay. i got so, one more question yeah are we gonna go fishing tomorrow are we gonna use swim jigs because <laughs> i would like to well they're already tied on i know I mean, the that convenience was, is that already was such there a blast. yeah everybody thanks for watching the sportsman's journal this week for sarah trampy i'm tyler trampy we'll see you again